Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today I've got something incredibly useful for anyone who deals with video files. We're digging deep into the world of MKV and MP4 formats. These are two of the most commonly used video file formats, but do you know which one is best for your needs? Stick around because we're about to find out. All right, let's kick things off by understanding what these acronyms actually mean. So what is MKV? It stands for Matroska Multimedia Container. That's quite a mouthful, isn't it? But what you need to know is that MKV is essentially a container for different types of media streams, like video, audio, and subtitles. The name Matroska comes from those Russian nesting dolls, which is a neat way of saying an MKV file can contain multiple layers of media. What is an MP4? MP4 is short for MPEG-4 Part 14. It's also a container format, but based on Apple QuickTime's MOV. While MP4 is more restrictive in terms of codecs it supports, it's a go-to format for a wide range of devices and applications. When it comes to video and audio quality, MKV is the winner. One of the first things people ask is which format has better quality, and the truth is, both MKV and MP4 are just containers. The real difference in quality comes from the codecs you use in these containers. However, MKV takes the cake here because it supports a broader range of high-quality codecs. When it comes to suitability for streaming, MP4 wins. If you're planning to stream your videos, MP4 is generally the better option. There's excellent support for streaming protocols like HLS and MPEG-DASH, making it more viable for both local and web streaming. When it comes to file size, it's pretty much a tie. Using the same codecs and settings, an MKV and MP4 file will be virtually identical in size. But MKV files can get hefty because they can hold multiple audio and video tracks. When it comes to compatibility, MP4 wins hands down. It's almost universally supported on devices and media players. With MKV, you might have to go out of your way to find a specialized player that will support it. But if you want a format that offers you the maximum amount of flexibility, MKV is the way to go. Whether it's multiple audio tracks, 3D video, or even lossless audio, MKV can handle it. You might find yourself in situations where you need to convert from MKV to MP4 or vice versa. But don't worry, it's pretty straightforward and there are lots of software options out there to help get the job done. However, when converting from MKV to MP4, you might have to choose one specific audio or video track since MP4 does not support multiple tracks. So which format should you go for? Well, if you want broader compatibility and easier streaming, MP4 is your guy. But if you need flexibility and are looking for better quality options, MKV won't let you down. And that wraps it up for today's video. If you found it useful, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more tech tips and tricks. See you next time.